Hey everyone, this is Chase at Rocky Mountain HVMC giving you a closer look at the Torque Drive Clutch Pack Kit from Recluse. All right, everyone, thank you for checking in. So listen up, if you are looking to upgrade the durability and performance of your clutch, if you're a clutch abuser, then this Torque Drive Clutch Pack from Recluse could be a really good upgrade for your motorcycle. I had this kit in my 2019 KX450. I'm not a clutch abuser, but it was still a great upgrade for me. I'll explain why and what are the things that I like so much about it. But as far as Recluse goes, a lot of people know them for their auto clutches. They also make really high quality manual clutches. In fact, Star Racing Yamaha team is one that really stands out to me. They're all using Recluse clutches. Tim Geiser uses Recluse. So a lot of top riders that are using their clutch components. What is cool about this clutch pack is that this is going to just drop into your OEM clutch that you have right now. So you don't have to swap out your clutch basket, your clutch hub, or anything like that. It's just what you see on the table. And what I like about this kit as well is that it saves you a lot of money. It still gives you good performance and durability, but you don't have to go out there and invest in, say, a thousand bucks to buy the entire core manual torque drive clutch, which we have a spotlight on that as well. But that will come with a new clutch basket, clutch hub, all the goodies. But if you're not just an insane clutch abuser, that's really not that necessary. So we'll talk more about that here in a little bit. But here's what comes included with this clutch pack. You're gonna have your new steel core friction discs, your drive plates, and then you're gonna have these steel basket sleeves, which I love, we'll talk more about these, and you will get a set of replacement springs that will also come included. Now when it comes to any clutch, the number one killer for these is heat. As you're riding, you're using your clutch, things start to heat up, and as your clutch components start to heat up, they start to expand, and then you have to start adjusting your clutch cable unless you have a hydraulic clutch, and when clutches get too hot, they start to slip, and eventually you get clutch fade, which we've all heard before, and then you start losing power to the rear wheel. And that is something that you do not want. That's why I say if you're a clutch abuser, this would be a really good upgrade because what this is designed to do is help eliminate as much clutch fade as possible. So you're always maintaining as much power to the ground as you can get, but also increasing the durability and longevity of your clutch components as well. So let's talk about how they do that with this kit. The real secret, and we'll put these steel plates aside for here just a moment, is in their steel core friction discs. So if you look at these, they are very unique looking. So, and these are made of steel versus aluminum that you're gonna normally have on OEM friction discs. And the reason that they use steel is that they don't expand as much as aluminum. So it can handle heat better. And like I just talked about, the more that you can keep your, com your components from expanding and be more resistant to heat, the better off you're going to be. Now to give you a good comparison, I have an OEM friction disc right here. And looking at these two side by side, you can see just how different they look. And also you notice too that with the steel core friction discs, look how narrow that is to compared to an OEM. It is a lot thinner. And when you have these inside your clutch, you'll actually get more of these steel core friction discs inside there versus OEM. Most OEM clutches come with either seven or eight friction discs. With this recluse, you have 12 in this specific clutch pack here. And the reason for that and why this is beneficial is that the more of these friction discs that you can have in your clutch that are taking up the same amount of space, the more friction pads you have, you're getting more surface area contacting and you're getting more friction and more torque. So these can handle more power, so again, it's gonna help you get that power to the ground. And because you're getting more of these, and we'll talk about their specialized friction pads in just a moment, it's gonna not expand as much, it's gonna be more resistant to that heat, so you're not gonna get clutch fade nearly as fast. So you're gonna maintain that power to the ground, that performance, even when things start to get hot. Now I mentioned that you have their friction pads, so looking at these, you can see it's very different as well. They use a specialized material that has a high energy capacity, meaning it does good with heat. And you can see the design of it's very unique, and the way that they design these friction pads is to help circulate oil throughout the clutch. The more that you can get oil circulating throughout your clutch when it's getting hot, the more it can take that heat away, so that's also very important. So these friction discs do two very important things. One, you're getting more surface area, more contact, getting that power to the ground. It's gonna help circulate oil flow to keep things cooler. In fact, our number that Recluse throws out is they say that on average, you're getting about 25% more torque to the ground over your OEM clutch, so pretty big difference there. Then with their steel plates, these are just gonna drop right into your OEM clutch hub. Now, I do wanna point out that this pack is not a direct replacement. If you have the core manual torque drive clutch that we talked about earlier, this is not a direct replacement. You wanna get the replacement clutch pack 
for the core manual clutch because the steel plates that they will include with this are meant for your OEM clutch hub, not theirs. So just keep that in mind. Now, last couple of things I'll point out, talked about the springs earlier. Again, these will come included. These are gonna be, as far as stiffness goes, very similar to your OEM springs. And last thing is something that I love, and it's these little sleeves for your clutch basket. These are made of steel. These drop right in between the fingers on your clutch basket. And what these do is just prevent you from notching that out. If anyone's ever seen a clutch basket that's been notched out from their friction plates, you know, when that starts to get bad enough, it doesn't feel good, it starts to get grabby, and eventually you need to replace your clutch basket, which is not cheap to do. So you drop these in and it prevents that from happening. So again, awesome to have. All right, so that's what's included in the, again, Torque Drive Clutch Pack. Awesome upgrade, a lot less expensive than their full clutch kit that you can buy. However, I had a good conversation with some guys over at Recluse, and here's what they kind of talked about. If you're the guy that's not abusive on clutches, kind of like me, and you're just looking for more durability and performance out of your clutch, then this setup would be a really good option. But if you are hard on clutches, you abuse them, or maybe you're a racer and you're looking to get the most performance and longevity and durability as possible, then maybe it's worth it to you to make the extra investment and get their core manual torque drive clutch, which will come with this clutch pack that we talked about, but you also get all the other components. You'll get a clutch cover, you'll get an inner hub, a pressure plate, basket, and that will give you the most durability possible. And when you're taking those components from Recluse, those they say are going to also help get the most oil flow possible. So you're also helping keeping the clutch a little bit cooler by going with that full setup. Again, that's going to come down to the rider and what you think is going to be best for you. As far as me, I had two years on my Kawasaki. I put well over 200 hours on that bike. And in that time frame, I only swapped out this clutch pack one time. And I honestly did it just because I felt like I should probably do it, not because it needed it. So for me, the longevity and the durability of this was awesome. My clutch basket, I had zero notching in it thanks to the steel sleeve. So overall, great performance and the longevity for me was just fantastic. So if that's what you are looking for and you're looking for a great upgrade, I definitely recommend checking out this clutch pack. If you have questions or comments, want to get those answered, so make sure to leave those below. To grab yours today, it's simple. Click on the link or head over to RockyMountainATVMC.com. When you're picking yours up, just enter the year, make, and model of the bike that you're shopping for. That will ensure that you get the correct clutch pack. And if you want to see the other spotlight videos that we have on, say, the Core Manual Torque Drive clutch or the other auto clutches that they have, we have great videos that we talk about those in full detail. I am Chase. We'll see you on the trails.